there, welcome to Over the Mooney. My name is Katie, and today we are going to be opening up this month's Wizard's Vault from Bippity Boppity Boxes. I absolutely adore this box and unbox this box. <laughs> How many times can I say box? Unbox this box every single month on my channel. So if this is something that you are interested in, you can definitely hit that subscribe button down below so that every single Wizard's Vault unboxing pops right on up in your subscription feed. So as always, I did just want to let you guys know that I am a rep for this company, for the Wizard's Vault specifically for Bippity Boppity Boxes. This company also does Disney subscription boxes if you are aware and that is something that you are interested in then you can check those out as well but if you are interested in the wizard's vault specifically then you can use my promo code over the mooney for seven dollars off your very first box there are two different price tiers there is the box that i am going to be opening up today which is just their standard one but then they also have a silver version of this box which is 49 dollars. so it's a little bit more cost effective if that's something that you're looking for and also i just want to let you guys know that this box is provided to me for review purposes for you guys Guys, and I am as always super super excited to see what's inside so I'm gonna go ahead and cut in so we can get into this box okay so we are opening up the box oh I love I love so it's very festive as soon as you open it up this is what you see so with a red tissue paper just instantly screams Christmas and holidays and then the little postcard says let your heart be Lumos I love that so much I'm going to definitely hold on to this postcard so that I can frame it and have it for the holiday season next year which I just absolutely love and then they have this little nice touch on the packing slip that says Ella Mora with this beautiful festive Christmas wreath around it so I'm a huge fan of both of those things and yay so yeah this is what we're looking like and I will say this does feel kind of heavy so I'm very curious to see what exactly is inside this box so I'm gonna go ahead and get right into it oh boy okay so first off there's something sticking up right here oh my god how cute this is perfect because if you guys watched my last unboxing which I'll link to down below and up in the cards if you did it then you'll know that I got a really beautiful Slytherin infinity scarf and this month I got a very beautiful pom-pom beanie I have been super super into pom-poms lately I actually bought a ton of pom-poms at Michael's um, because they were actually on sale which is a plus and I want to make some pom-pom beanies I want to crochet them oh my god this is so cute and I love that it even comes with this really nice bag that there we can see it a little better it says Harry Potter on it which I will probably keep not necessarily to keep my hat in but just to like store things in it oh this is cute I love it with the pom-pom so much fun so I'll probably I'll rock this for the rest of the video so then I'm seeing a pin <gasps> oh my god what is this from nmagusco.com I love this so much <laughs> so I'm such a big I love if you guys don't know me hi I'm a big fan of villains so it should come as no surprise that I love the Death Eaters in this movie series and the book series. I think that they're such cool characters. And I love the Malfoy family so much. Lucius is probably top five characters for me. I love him. So I got this awesome fantasy pin. Like I said, the company is called AnimagusCo.com. They are on, I'm assuming Instagram at AnimagusCo. I will link to both down below. And I got this Malfoy button. It says Potter Stinks on it. It's kind of like the Triwizard Tournament buttons where the Cedric ones were kind of going back and forth. <sighs> it has the Death Eater symbol on it. I'm just, it's glitter. I'm obsessed. Obsessed with this pin. This is so pretty. Oh my god, I love this. Looks like there's a t-shirt, but it's kind of under some other stuff, so I'm gonna keep going with the other stuff to get out the t-shirt. Ooh, yay, I think we got a candle. It looks like a Wishes candle. <gasps> yay, 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 yay. I was actually just having a conversation with someone about how I really have not bought myself very many Wishes candles lately, which is kind of a crime. <laughs> um, 
because I love them. I think that they're so pretty and they always smell so nice, but I feel like I'm kind of on candle overload right now, so I need to burn through a lot of candles before I can justify purchasing candles. But if they show up in my subscription boxes, I'm not gonna be mad about it. So this candle is called Happy Christmas, and it has the lightning scar in the background. It is a Bippity Boppity Box exclusive, and it's gray, which is one of my favorite colors too. So let's see what color the glitter is. Oh, pretty, it's like a rose gold glitter. Oh my God, this is like my two favorite colors together. So that is what it looks like. I don't wanna tip it too much because it'll spill. That is a nice, nice scent. It has like a touch of spice to it, but definitely like a balsam pine tree scent also. I really, really like this one a lot. I think that there are just two more items left in here. <laughs> I can't be 100% certain, but I'm gonna go for the t-shirt. Oh, yay. Oh my God, yes, yes, yes. I love this. And it's so funny because I was just having a conversation. My, so my aunt is also really into Harry Potter. She's pretty much the reason why I even got, <clears throat> got into Harry Potter. She convinced me. And I was saying how I don't feel like I see very much Harry po or Hogwarts alumni merchandise. I see a lot of very house specific stuff. I see a lot of Hogwarts merch, but I don't ever feel like I see a lot of Hogwarts alumni merch. And my dad actually got her a tumbler that said Hogwarts alumni on it. But now I have this awesome Hogwarts alumni like long, I think it's long sleeve or maybe like three quarter length sleeve shirt. It's tie dye. I have no tie dye shirts in my life right now. Oh, I love this. It feels kind of like, like an exercise material. You know what I mean? Like, oh, I, I don't know how to describe it. It's very soft which is nice, uh, but it's not super like fleecy or anything on the inside, but it's really, really soft and I'm obsessed with this. I love the tie-dye colors on here. It's really pretty, very pastel -y. This is actually an official Harry Potter item too, and I've never seen this. I swear they continue to surprise me with the items that they find that are Harry Potter things that I just don't ever find in regular stores and I never see them. Um, which is awesome because I feel like I can just go out and buy myself Harry Potter stuff in the store and not really ever have to worry about anything being duplicated in my box. So I think, I think that this is my last item. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Wow. This is why this box was so heavy. I got a goblet and it's not just any goblet. It is a Slytherin goblet, you guys. Oh my gosh. I need to get this out. I'm so excited. I love a goblet. <laughs> like I will never ever use this to actually drink out of. Oh yeah, you actually can use it to drink. Not a toy or child's product intended for adults only. Hand wash with cold water. Do not soak in water. Hmm. I just thought, I mean, it does say decorative, but I don't know that it, like it necessarily, oh my God. Oh my God, this is so amazing. Okay, 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 this is different. Okay, so it actually is lined on the inside with metal, which makes me feel a lot better about life and about drinking out of it if I so choose, but oh my good God. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh. There are green gems all over this. This is so Slytherin and I am living for this. I love this. I don't think that I will drink out of this because I don't want to ruin it as I <laughs> just caress it like a child. Um, I don't want to damage it or ruin it in any way. I will just use it to store things in or just maybe to put on display somewhere. I need to redo my shelves. I started on it and then it's just, it's a lot of work. <laughs> so I, uh, I gave up pretty quickly, but <laughs> I'm going to have to work this into my decor because this is stunning. I love this. Let me give you guys a close up so you can see how beautiful it is. All right, you guys, so that is everything that is in that box. So I'm gonna go ahead 
and to check my packing slip here. So, Harry Potter Hogwarts alumni tie-dye sweater is $32. Harry Potter decorative goblet Slytherin is $35. The Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes by Wishes Candle Co. Exclusive Candle Happy Christmas is $20. Your Animagus Co. Harry Potter Fantasy Pin Malfoy is $12. And the Harry Potter Cine Replicas Palm Beanie Slytherin is $17.50 for a grand total of $116.50. Wow, wow, these boxes just continue to blow me away. They find such amazing stuff and I just, I love this box so much. Every time I love one box, I feel like the next box just tops it tenfold. So I'm super, super obsessed with this whole box. I can't pick a favorite because I love absolutely everything. I love having a cute little palm beanie and I love my goblet and my candle and my shirt. I just love everything. This was just perfect. So you guys have to let me know what was your favorite item if you are able to choose because I would love to know in the comments down below and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it because how could you not, right? It was so good. It was such a great box. So I hope that you did enjoy it. I'm curious to see how they impressed me again next month. So definitely hit that subscribe button so that you'll be able to see my next month's box. And until then, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.